but there's that severe weather risk, an enhanced risk that's level three out of five. You can see right in the middle of our scale there, uh, and that's what we're looking at all of South Louisiana, South Mississippi as well too. Damaging winds, tornadoes, yes, are likely with these storms as we go into your Saturday. Now the threat again for rainfall is also high, a moderate threat there for two to four inches of rain could cause some flooding. High winds, a moderate threat, hail's not a big threat, and tornadoes also a moderate threat out there as well too. So we need to stay weather aware during the day tomorrow. Here's how our time's out for you today. Some clouds build in, not much of any kind of rain, 20% chance windy weather out there. Few sprinkles tonight into tomorrow morning. Then here come the storms. Now our latest models keeping them back in Baton Rouge at noon. Other models do have it closing in on the city. So again, anywhere from late morning to noon, we need to stay weather aware tomorrow, continuing through two o'clock, four o'clock in the afternoon. These storms again could produce some damaging winds and tornadoes tomorrow. The longer it takes for them to get here, the greater the chance of them being severe and maybe even stronger storms out there as we warm up and become more unsafe. Stable. So there you see by four o'clock through six o'clock, the storms coming in and then heavy rain continues through eight o'clock through 10 o'clock in the evening. Finally, by midnight, two o'clock in the morning, the rain gets out of here into early Sunday morning. So that's what we need to stay well aware of what's going on on top of the severe weather two four inches of rain, not out of the question for us on Saturday. So obviously street flooding issues could be a problem. Some minor low lying areas could see some water as well.